I'm Helen and I'm the events manager for Radio 3 and I am basically running the Radio 3 stage and the stage is situated in a beautiful arboretum here in Charlton Park and at the moment I'm sitting backstage because um, that's the main place where I operate. I make sure that everybody um, works together to uh, make this the Hill Festival happen and uh, to make sure that all the bands perform on time and that our radio producers um, record uh, good sounds and that our presenters know where to do, uh, know where to go and what to do, rather. And I've been working in setting all of this up for quite a few months now, so this is a kind of big culmination of quite a long journey. We've come here uh, for a recce in February, had a look at the site, um, decided where we were going to position our stage, um, and then we were here all week, setting up, and we started yesterday. We had a whole day full of concerts, which run very, very well, and a very big crowd out there because we've been here a few years now and the people have really come to like the Radio 3 stage because we're offering something um, a little bit different from the main stage. We're offering smaller acoustic sets um, which fit very well here with uh, the Arboretum because the whole vibe is very, very chilled out and the idea is really to offer people a very intimate concert experience. Um, and we tend to book bands who are either living in the UK or not too far because we're working with modest budgets but we like to program smaller acoustic sets as I said and sometimes those bands do bigger uh, sets on the main stages but they come especially for us and they do smaller acoustic sets at the moment we're sound checking Victor Deme who's a singer-songwriter from Burkina Faso who will just do an unplugged session for us but he'll be performing later on one of the bigger stages and um, yeah, the highlights for me yesterday was Simaron, who are um, some fantastic rancheros, which means uh, cattle hurdles from Colombia. And they gave us a fantastic performance in the crowds. So there's about, I guess, about two, three thousand people out there just going wild. They're very fast and furious and dancing on stage, playing the cuatros, and they're just uh, fantastic guys who actually um, are kettle herders from the heartlands in Colombia and they just brought the whole for a fantastic energy and a fantastic great virtuosity to the stage and the people just loved it and we had who else did we have we had uh, Dennis Bovell one of the legends here uh, of dub in the UK who you know we thought would be great to get because you know he's very much world music too and you know has contributed greatly to you know, the dub scene here in the UK so there you go very two, two very different acts and that's the whole you know, big thing about WOMED is that you just come for just about anything and in there you'll find something that you like and you'll find a jewel that you like and it's just a great variety of stuff and you know really great atmosphere so there we go